Creating a template file with automated functionality streamlines your sheet creation process and saves you a ton of time. I'm going to show you how to create a template file. The alignment has a profile manager. It's best to start with an already existing template file and then has a 3D model. I'm gonna go ahead and start the Civil 3D. It takes a few seconds to open. I'm gonna close the task pane because I'm not gonna need it for what we're gonna be doing. Now I'm going to go ahead and open the existing template file in our exercise files. So I'm gonna go application menu, open. And at the bottom of my select file box, I wanna make sure that my file type is set to drawing template DWT. Once it's set to DWT, which it already is, it will take you to the template folder location. However, we are going to use a template from our exercise files. So I'm going to navigate to my exercise files. In chapter one, I'm going to open the Civil 3D Imperial Plan and Profile template. Now that I'm in my template file, what I'm going to do is I'm going to delete the extra things that I'm not going to need. Specifically, I'm going to delete the layouts. The layouts that we are going to be using are going to be ANSI D 40 scale layouts. When we create our sheets, we're going to create sheets that are ANSI D. So I'm going to delete all of the layouts that are not ANSI D. I'm going to come down here, left click on the first one here, Arch D, hold the shift key down, select this third one here, right click, delete. Now I'm going to delete the Arch E ones. Left click, hold the shift key down, left click on this last one, right click, delete. It's just asking me, are you sure you want to delete these? Yes, I do. Okay. And so now I am left with my one ANSI D plan and profile 40 scale. And I'm going to go ahead and rename this just to show you how to do it. And I'm going to remove the and and just put an ampersand in there instead, make it a little bit shorter. Now, the last thing I want to do before editing and adding more information to my layout, I'm going to delete everything in this layout. So I'm going to go ahead, select everything, hit the delete key. Now I'm going to save my template. I'm going to come in here to save as and make sure you do a save as because if you just do save, you're just going to save over the already existing template file. And I'm going to save in my exercise files folder. I'm going to name my new template file, Dorlin Avenue Plan Profile Section, to indicate that this is a template file for creating plan, profile, and section sheets. Save button. It's going to ask me for a description. Going to give it a description. This is Dorland Avenue Plan Profile. Okay. Creating the template file is only the beginning. We also need to set up the title block and create text fields for the template file, which is covered in subsequent videos.